Hi, this is Andy from Tim's Minions, and today I'm going to do a review of the Tweet Adder software. Tweet Adder is an awesome Twitter software that allows you to follow and unfollow lots of people on autopilot. With Tweet Adder, you can have licenses for one Twitter account, five or unlimited Twitter accounts. There is a one time cost, so there are no monthly charges. With Tweet Adder, you can do a search through tweets on keywords. You can follow and unfollow people on autopilot. You can follow people who follow other users. For example, if Frank Kern had several hundred thousand people, you could do a search of Frank Kern and start to follow the followers of Frank Kern. TweetAdder will allow you to send out automated thank you follow messages. For people who have followed you, you can send out a message to them which includes a link to your website or product. You can send out tweets on autopilot and you can follow and unfollow manually in bulk. So below this video you'll find that there is a link to TweetAdder. So here we are, this is the TweetAdder software. As you can see I am actually in the overview. Um, these green buttons here show that certain parts are on automated. Um, so you've got follow, follow back, unfollow, tweet and search are on. Um, automated then there are things that are not switched on to be automatic there's a reason for that because if you're not careful and you're doing everything on auto automatic Twitter might start to think that you are a piece of software which is actually against their terms and conditions um, so you don't want to be seen as being automatic you want to be seen as being natural as possible as you can see here on the Tim's Minions it's got following back and following um, that's on your status now it's idle but when it's doing something it'll show what it's doing we have 3,993 following um, we've had 94 today uh, and followers we have 3,629 we've done 52 today we sent out three updates which are your tweets uh, and we have one left in the system okay so quickly go through um, the software when you actually on Tim's Minions if you click the visit profile button it will open up your Twitter page which is this one's ours um, you will need to log in but basically when you set this system when you put your computer on in the morning and you switch tweet adder on it will automatically log into your Twitter account see it does that if you go into the manage users section you can add um, your Twitter username and you get a license. We have a license here for five. Um, so once you put in your Twitter name there and your Twitter password and then highlight that and then add user, you then will automatically add your Twitter account to your tweet adder software. So that's where you manage users. And so back to the overview. Now if you wanted to start setting up some of these automated systems, you will go into open user and then you'll choose from the drop down menu of the um, the account you want to use. So now as you can see down here we have these are automated searches as you can see on keywords we have a tweet search which is on automated and we're using certain keywords of internet marketers um, and every so often this will basically do a search of tweets that have mentioned these people's names or people's uh, companies and then it will add them to a to follow list. But you, you can do a search, for example, if I put in the keyword make money online, um, you can choose any language if you want. We just go for really English, recency, um, in days. So let's go for example, the last day uh, with 25 miles. We won't put a location, so that should search around the world. But if we just do a quick now search now. And you can see it's extracting IDs from page four, five, six. Now if I quickly just press stop, there we go. How to make your blog a successful online marketing tool. It started make money with no money, I make money online. It's basically started to search Twitter for tweets that have had those keywords put in. If you want to press save all, that will stick them into your to follow list. Uh, and as you can see here, we have a list of people that we are slowly following. Um, 
So now you've got profile data search, local location search, followers of a user, followed by a user, and your Twitter lists. But if I put a followers of a user, so if I put a Twitter user, um, for example, we put at Tim's minions, and then click search. Oh no, if I just press stop. Now it's coming up with a list of the people who are following Tim's minions. Again, we could press save all and then that will put them into our follow list, uh, ready to follow. Obviously I don't really want to be following my own fans, so I, I won't. Um, so if we go down to here now to follow, click on the follow, as you can see we've got the green light on which is automated. We have it to send um, out to try and follow 200 people per day. Uh, a maximum is 300 on the automation settings, sorry. This is for the manual settings. We try and follow no more than 300 a day, mainly because if you're not careful, if you start doing thousands, Twitter will realise that you're using automated software and they can close your account down. We have a time delay between 1 and 4 minutes and it's basically to um, make it look like you're human. If you're just following everyone every second, you know, people can't do it that quick. So it's to make it look like you are human. Um, but once you set it to automation, it'll uh, it'll start following people throughout the day. As long as the software is switched on, it'll start following people uh, and building up your lists. If you wanted to start following people in bulk, simply put in a number here, um, put in the time delay between 3 and 8 seconds, and then hit start. So now it's starting to follow uh, people off our, our list, off our follow list. I shall stop that now. And the same with followbacks. Followbacks are people who have followed you and you've yet to follow back. It will do it automatically uh, if you want to set up these. Uh, times and how many people just follow. If I press start now, follow backs ended. That's because we are mainly following people who are following us back after. Um, so we don't tend to have many follow backs. Unfollow users. It is said that if you are following people and they haven't followed you back within three days, then unfollow them because chances are they either don't go on Twitter much or they're not likely to be um, following you back at all and because Twitter only allows you to have so many people per as like a percentage um, it's best to get rid of those you don't need them so again automation is set up for 300 unfollows per day uh, and if you want to do it in bulk again you press start so it starts to unfollow people and as you can see down here, it will unfollow non-followers that we're following using TweetAdder. We're waiting three days to follow uh, before we unfollow them. So I shall stop that now. Now this is the best uh, section, the tweets. i uh, show you how to set up a tweet. So here we go. This is now the tweet section again, which is set up to automatic. Now, if you want to tweet someone a link to your blog post, you know, you put it in here and then you set it up just press add and then set it up to go throughout the day so let's just quickly do that for example and this is on our Twitter, we've now got loads of got loads of tweets coming through from people who we're following um, but if we go to Google Reader for instance now Google Reader is a great way of getting um, blog posts and articles sent to you basically, instead of having to search Google for lots of them, you set up keywords and then go looking for an interesting uh, post that you want to share with people. See, so, yeah, what's some of the blog tips? How often should you be blogging? Let's have a quick look at this. So if you click on the link, it'll open up the page. It's quite a long blog, yeah, it's quite interesting. Uh, personal blogging, blogging for business, uh, while you're doing this search for Twitter, um, looking for posts to share, it might be worth, if you're interested, see, there we are, I've actually commented on this one, Andy the Minion. Um, so yeah, if you're, uh, when you're looking for 
articles and posts to share you might as well do some what they call blog commenting because that way it helps bring traffic back to your site because people click on there now and they can come to Tim's Minions um, so it does uh, it does bring people to your site right so what you would do now is you're at this site what you would do is basically copy the blog headline because I've already posted this I'm going to put reposting this as I make a video tutorial here it tells you the amount of um, characters you can have as well because as you probably know with uh, Twitter you're only allowed to have a hundred and forty characters per tweet as they call it I'm just gonna make the headline stand out a little now the next thing is you need the link which the link would be technically up here what I recommend you do is get an account with bitly bitly is a link shortening company as you can see there that's the link because I've already done it I'm gonna copy the link again just shortened it and I'm gonna post it in there so now I've got the whole tweet there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this because then I'm going to show you. You can, if you click Add, it now adds it to your list of tweets. So you can set up a whole day's worth of tweets in this uh, this box here. And your post, you set your post, your tweets to go out every 40 to 50 minutes or maximum tweets per day. How many you want to do? We can put them in random order. Um, so you can set them to go every one or two minutes depending on what you want to do we try and not over tweet um, so again I'm going to post this in here because from now I'm going to show you is that if I press the button tweet now that will disappear if I go back to the Tim's Minions just keep there we go reposting this as I make a video tutorial so that now has automatically been sent to my Twitter account. Now if I click on there that should take me to that blog page. And there you see. Um, while you're in Twitter you can, it's also worth checking your, uh, your connection, see if people have retweeted or you know who has joined your page. That's one thing with the tweet adder software is that everything is automated but you still want to be able to talk and chat. Hootsuite is great because you can keep an eye out on who you're connecting with but with things like Hootsuite they have a a recurring monthly fee at least with TweetAdder it's just a one payment and then you get this software that you can set up to run throughout the day following, unfollowing and sending tweets so here we got down here now again is the thank you message this here is where when someone um, follows you a message is automatically sent out to the person and here we have we a little message which is the Tim's Minions, the R&D team for Tim Lowe uh, with a link to a uh, squeeze page or some information about us and Tim and that is set to go automatic. If you wanted to turn the automation on and off you just click these buttons here. With TweetAdder you get brilliant contact support you just need to click this button here and then you can send messages to people at TweetAdder if there's any information any any issues because sometimes Twitter change their API code and if that's the case it may affect your login into your Twitter account then Twitter will uh, sorry Twitter TweetAdder will quickly change that and then update your uh, software and uh, once you've paid for it you get updates for life basically but on the whole there's not really much else you need to know. Pro Tools, I've not looked into that, I've never used that. Um, if you wish to have a look into that, you may. But simply, that that's really what TweetAdder is. So you can set it up for search, uh, to send a thank you message, to tweet, to unfollow, to follow back, to follow. Um, what you do is just load up all your tweets for the day and then get on with the rest of your day obviously like I say it's worth having your Twitter account open because sometimes people will send you a message and you will need to chat as you'll probably see down here where there are people who I chat to about 
Twitter related and internet internet marketing related products or information so it's a great way it is a social network and it's all about socializing so you know you want to make sure that your Twitter pages are open so you can keep an eye on and chat with people if need be we've got uh, say 3,631 followers which we're building up every day on autopilot and then you write a blog post and then you send a tweet out to all those thousands of people about your um, your new blog post you'll start to get people coming to your blog and eventually your numbers will start to increase on your website it's uh, Twitter is brilliant for traffic so that there is the um, Twitter uh, tweet adder software please note before connecting your Twitter accounts to this software have them established and running for a few weeks first manually follow and unfollow people and manually send tweets before you connect tweet adder to your account otherwise Twitter will become suspicious and delete your account it has happened before and it will happen again make sure you do this part first it is important do not set up a new account connect it with tweet adder then run it on autopilot as it will get your Twitter account shut down follow this rule and you'll be fine but remember Twitter do not like the use of third party automated software it is part of their terms and conditions make sure your Twitter accounts are established first I hope you found this video to be helpful and just below the video you'll find a link to TweetAdder